This segment is sponsored in part by Con Edison, committed to providing 100% clean energy by 2040. What's one of the hottest career paths? It may be clean energy. Demand for green jobs is expected to soar as buildings start to reduce emissions. And as part of its clean energy commitment, Con Edison is investing in green job training. Now's your opportunity to jump in and make a difference, not only in the environment, but in your career. Okay. What we want to do now is that I want you to run another, create another GFCI. You're going to have a GFCI here. What does the GFCI stand for? You're looking at Soulful Synergy hard at work in New Rochelle. This group, which is part of the Clean Energy Academy, is leveling up their skills to advance in their careers and ultimately help take care of the environment. David Sparber, a graduate of this program, says the on-hand experience is invaluable. What impact do you think the work that you're doing now, what impact does that have on sustainability and clean energy? The environment is in dire need of, of assistance, you know, and the only way to make the changes is to teach people how to do these jobs and how to assess the issues. Con Edison is now looking for new community partners like Soulful Synergy to expand the green workforce as it has committed to powering New York with 100% clean energy by 2040. Can you tell us about Con Edison's Green Workforce Initiative? Con Edison's vision is for every New Yorker to be able to share in the benefits of the clean energy transition. And that's why it's providing an initial grant of $1 million to help educational institutions and partners recruit and train the next generation of professionals in clean energy and technology. We have a number of partners that we call uh, a village. Right, so on one side you have the, the program delivery partners such as New York Institute of Technology which helps with our curriculum development. And then on the other side we have outreach and recruitment partners which helps us identify students that will be best fit for the program. Why exactly is Con Edison taking lead with the green workforce? We believe that New Yorkers who are disproportionately impacted by climate change should also play the largest part in shaping New York's clean energy future. Sean Hoyt, who is with Con Edison's Clean Energy Network, says the overall health of New York is the priority, and that means including people with different backgrounds who will make an impact. There is a minimum of 50% in the program. Participants must come from priority populations. That's disadvantaged communities, that's people with disabilities, that's returning citizens or formerly incarcerated, and then veterans. Um, I'm happy to report that our numbers to date, we have 70% of participants that come from priority populations. Liz Codina says the collaboration in the classroom is helping her reach her goal of becoming an energy efficient manager. I was definitely pleasantly surprised about the fact that they made it super interactive. There was a lot of knowledge to be, you know, absorbed. It makes sense. And it makes sense because this vocational training program came from a real market need. At Con Edison, the utilities are asking all buildings to improve their energy efficiency, starting with lighting, but getting into other areas like HVAC, like boilers, like the shell of the building. And this training was in direct response to that so that we would have the workforce to help us upgrade our building. The Clean Energy Academy started in 2020 and has graduated nearly 1,000 students. There's no prerequisite for you to get in it's a very rigorous interview process because we want to make sure that all participants, all students, all graduates want to maintain a relation with us pre and post graduation. This is a very important endeavor that, that we are putting forth to the market where we understand that there are good paying jobs in this arena, where there are lasting positive impacts in the environment. And we want to make sure that the participants of this program are committed, willing and able to learn and be successful in this space. How would you encourage other folks, um, or what, what would you say to them if they were considering taking this program? I would tell them to join right now because it's, it's a life lesson that you learn. If you have no experience in clean energy, it doesn't matter. You know, we'll find what you can do here, we'll find your spot, and if you have to learn something, you learn it. Learning that will not only benefit you, but your community and New York for a lifetime. If you are a community-based organization or learning institution and want to partner with Con Edison in their Green Workforce Initiative, check out the requirements at coned.com slash clean energy careers and email grant proposals to powerofgiving at coned.com before October 30th at 5 p.m. And if you'd like to learn more about Con Edison's commitment to a clean energy future, visit coned.com slash clean energy.